In this video, I'm going to be breaking down the best defense post-patch in Madden 25, and it is in the Minnesota Vikings playbook. If you guys want to get my entire Minnesota Vikings defensive ebook, you can get access to all of our offensive and defensive ebooks by becoming school community members. Those links are going to be in the description down below for just 10 bucks. You get access to all of our offensive and defensive ebooks for both Madden and for College Football 25, as well as all of the updates. And this defense, in my opinion, is the best pressure in the game. Now, the way you're going to run this defense, at least in my opinion, I'm going to show you a couple different ways in this video. Uh, one of the biggest keys with this defense is you need to have fast outside linebackers. So we have some fast outside linebackers on this team. We're going to turn auto flip defense a play call off. You can really do whatever else that you want with the defense. You can run this on baseline. We'll cover that in just a minute. Uh, but basically what you're going to do is you're going to come out in this play pinch buck zero. And when you come out of this play pinch bug zero, it's going to walk this linebacker down into the box. From there, you can send uh, this blitz in a lot of different ways. Now, typically what I like to do is press and then back off my outside corner. So it looks kind of something like this. And uh, just to kind of start this defense off, what we're going to do is we're just going to take this left of screen linebacker and we're just going to man him up to the running back to have everybody manned up. And the reason we're going to do that is just because it's a simple send five. And you're going to see that this send five should come around on the edge. We'll show that again. The biggest trick with this defense is truly the hover. Um, the hover is really what makes this defense special and what makes this defense work. So you've got to kind of really get that guard to commit. And if you can get that guard to commit, then this blitz will come in. And you can pretty much send any of the linebackers. So for example, let's say we wanted to do something like this. Where we take this middle linebacker man him up to the tight end now we have this cross man on the tight end we're gonna have to kind of watch the tight end but you'll see that if we send this we can get double edge potentially get that edge linebacker so as you see you're able to get a send five on five and get good pressure with this another thing you could do with this defense though is as this game goes on they're gonna block their running back and, there's, and so when they start to block their running back this is where it's really advantageous to go ahead and just basically not cover the running back and you're going to send six, and you're going to see that the six man is going to come in. It's going to come in really fast. It's really difficult for them to block with the blocked running back. Now, also, the thing that's really cool about this defense is if they block a tight end. So here, they're going to block a tight end. Now, we're going to have to go guard the running back ourselves, but you're going to see that this blitz is still going to work against a blocked tight end. So it's really difficult to pick this blitz up regardless of their pass, pro their pass protection and situationally, another thing that you can do with this is you could send five off the running back side. So let's say we're, you know, want to have a little bit more coverage to the tight end. So we're going to man the tight end up. Maybe we do a little scissor adjustment over here and send five like this. And you'll see that this send five is normally going to be pretty consistent and you're going to get that pressure off the right side. So if you want to send it off the right side, another thing that you can do is you can go ahead and play kind of like this where you're using over here to the left a little bit more. You're going to get that clean edge pressure like so. And as you see, so this, this defense is literally all about the hover of the user that is going to trigger these pressures. Now, another thing that you can do uh, with this defense is occasionally you can get this four man uh, to be able to come in on this right side. Um, doesn't always come in, but you're going to get good sheds out of that. And the, in game, it's a little better than practice mode. But I did want to cover how to run this defense on out of like a base alignment type of look so if i wanted to be base aligned what i like to do is i like to come out and pinch buck and then i'm going to audible to other plays the best plays in my opinion to run this defense out of is either tampa two cover three sky or you could also run it out of like a cover six look and get some match coverage on the field so what you're going to see here is we're going to go to a cover six. As you see, we get this basic alignment. The big tip I have with this is to bring these safeties into the box. If you don't do that, you're going to get seam streaked. But in general, this send four is going to be pretty good. As you see, we get that nice send four off of that left side. And then let's say we wanted to send four off of the right side. We can go to a cover three look, bring this guy down, quarter him, quarter him. And then, you know, we can kind of have like a little cover four defense. And now we're going to try to send four off of this right side as you see these four man blitzes are really good and they're really good to switch stick out of and then what you can do is you can also situationally just blitz all your linebackers you're going to put your user in a coverage assignment i like to shade underneath here and now we're going to play a little cover two hybrid zone defense and now if they try to block this blitz you're going to get pressure off of the edge 
Thanks for watching this video. If you guys want to check out the entire 3-4-Odd Defense Minnesota ebook is in our school community. Link in the description below.